My friends, welcome to SkyPie Network. My name is Donnie, and in today's video, we're gonna talk about. Uh. Oh. Oh. Who? Let's try that again. In today's video, we're gonna. Uh. <laughs> Crap, I forgot what I was gonna say. In, t in today's video, we're gonna. Dude, who needs intros for this? All right, in today's video, we're gonna talk about the fuck. We're gonna talk about how I don't even sound like this. I actually sound like this. Hi. Hi, Beshas. It's Donnie Pooh. <laughs> OMG, Besh. This video is gonna be so lit, Besh. Girl, it is gonna be so lit, Besh. Hey, hey, we did it. We did it. I'm <laughs> just kidding. I'm not going to talk like that in this entire video. That would be annoying. Bash. <laughs> so I took the time to find the 10 best Avakin Life Instagram accounts because there are so many and I just want to give them shout outs. I rated this, in my opinion, from the worst to the best of the top 10. Coming in at number 10, Colette Love. Now, some of you might know Colette from her YouTube videos and her adorable laugh, but did you know Colette Love has an Instagram page? She usually posts new updates with what's happening in Avakin Life, alongside new uploads from her YouTube channel. Colette is one of the most known YouTubers in the game, so if you're a fan of Avakin Life content creators, she's definitely someone you should follow. Okay, number 9, Avakin Life Official. So, the official Avakin Life Instagram page updates you with everything happening in Avakin Life. For example, like myself, I waste so much time on Instagram, I go from clicking one image to clicking another and another, which is why I'm thankful for Avakin Life Official because they update every single day. And besides that, the Avakin Life Official page receives a ton of comments. So feel free to join whenever you have a chance. Number eight, Avakin Life Daily. Cyberbullying is something that happens online. And to be honest, I've been on the internet for quite a while now, and I've dealt with my fair share of internet bullies. So it's nice to have someone like AL Daily who stands up against cyberbullying by spreading positivity. She's a reblogger. Many of the edits on her page give exposure to lesser known Avakin Life editors, and from time to time, she posts inspiring quotes to help you survive through the day. For example, one day, someone will walk into your life and make you see why it never worked out with anyone else. Thank you, AL Daily, for all you do. Number seven, Nyx1513, otherwise known as Phoenix. Now we're getting into the artistic, <laughs> now we're getting into the artistic I said artistic side, not autistic, but we're getting to the artistic side of the Avakin Life Instagram pages, which are some of my favorite TBH. See, Phoenix is a sweet talker. He's a gentleman. His Instagram page will give you them feels, bro. I especially love his video edits. For example, he just uploaded one the other day titled Bonnie and Clyde. This is what it looks like. Okay, so we're not gonna watch the entire video, but that's just an example of the amazing work that he does. And today, I feel like we live in a world where there's just so much negativity, and it's nice to have a breath of fresh air where people can be positive toward one another. For, for me, for example, some days I don't feel the best, and then other days, you feel amazing. I feel like if we support one another and make each other feel great, then the world will be a better place. I challenge everyone who's watching this video to say one nice thing to someone today. And sorry, I just, I needed to say that, but we're going back to the video. It's just something that needed to be said. Number six, Adam Orio. Adam's page is, um, what well, I think it's dedicated to his girlfriend who he plays Avakin Life with. I think that's the thing that's amazing about Avakin Life. It's a platform that really connects people to one another. And sometimes you don't even expect it, right? But to see Adam post so much and, you know, play the game with his girlfriend, I think that's a really good bond. And I could say Adam's page is really poetic. It tells a story, the good and bad about life. I think that's the thing I really enjoy about his page. 
Number five is Laffy Taffy. Besides from having the most delicious name ever, Laffy Taffy does create good artwork. And I'll fight anyone who says otherwise. <laughs> just kidding. I'm just kidding. I don't really like to fight. But she does make good edits, right? Right into the news! Laffy's made huge improvements from the beginning of all her pages. So this was one of her first edits she's ever uploaded. And this one as well. And this one. So you can see this is how it used to look when she would upload. But now when we go to her most recent uploads, she's just improved so much. And I really love that when she does take a photo, her focus is so much on the eyes of her avatar. And I think that's what really makes a lot of her photos pop out is that it's just aesthetically pleasing. Almost 600 posts to her Instagram page. That's a madness. And most of them are absolute art. Uh, I honestly want to blow some of her images up and just place them on my wall. And the only bad thing is she hasn't posted to her Instagram page in over a month. But one like one image I love is this one. It's like light and dark, good and bad, day and night. Or this one, which definitely is how I feel sometimes. I mean, we can go through photo after photo after photo. Like, it's just, it's crazy how many photos she's updated. And all of them are like really good too. So. I think you guys should all like, check out her page for sure, Dale Avakin, and hopefully inspire her to start posting again. Okay, next is Lola Avakin. Amazing work. Lola's edits are a blend of Avakin life and actual art. Like this, for example. She uses brushwork along with Avakin life to create something new. And I can honestly say that's just super creative. And when I think of Avakin life at Tumblr, I definitely think her page meets that expectation and beyond it, hands down. Avakin life on Instagram truly is the new norm for social media in gaming, and you can see why. The content creators on this platform have super high quality. And I mean, I just, I love people who create things. I've always wanted to date an artist. I mean, like what guy doesn't want to date a girl who's just like great at art? I think artists are fuego. Number two, Celeste. She's cool. I like I like Celeste a lot, actually. Uh, she's a little weird, but I think she has my type of humor. And I think weird's a good thing, right? Like, weird's not bad. Uh, I mean, her art isn't really weird. Her art is more beautiful than weird. I mean, obviously. Like, look at this one. I think this speaks volumes, and it says something. At least it says something to me. And I love that she includes quotes to some of her images. This one says, Dream no small dreams, for they have no power to move hearts. If I can do it, so can you. And so, like, as I go down her page, and as you can see, they're all, like, really amazing. Wow, look at this one. Well, that is so cool. Gun. Like, I wonder how she did that. See, she does, like, some really good artwork. And I think that's the thing with Avakin Life is that it allows artists to take things from the game and really make something entirely new from it. And I'm sure the developers love seeing the content creators from their game. And Avakin Life should do a better job, like, promoting you know, uh, the people on their games artwork and whatnot. And there should be like a feed where we can post Instagram photos just within Avakin Life. That'd be really cool. And the number one best Instagram page, a drum roll please, uh, is me because I'm the best. <laughs> no, no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding, it's not me. The number one best Instagram page is Broken Doll X. Her artwork is flawless like Beyonce. That's the song. <laughs> no, no, for real though. Uh, all, her all her photos since the beginning of time are amazing. And I actually asked her out one time, but she rejected me and I got like really sad and depressed. I ate so much pizza and ice cream for a while and now I'm like super fat in real life. That's why some people wonder why I don't do in real life vlogs. I just tell them it's because Broken Doll X broke my heart and you know, I'll never be the same again. <laughs> Broken doll. Uh, why'd you do this to me? Anyway, <laughs> I'm just joking. I never, I, I don't even know what she looks like. Um, also, you guys should just go uh, follow her on her page. Uh, check the links in the description below so you can see everyone in this video. Okay, that's the end of the video. I just want to give one quick shout out to Ray Rose Avakin Love. She helped me do this entire thing. Um, I think she got suspended recently so hopefully she gets her account back okay we're back we're back here 
Uh, thank you guys all for watching. If you have an Instagram page, just comment it down below. I'll follow you. Also, don't forget to follow me back at Donnie Pie. Uh, this season's coming to an end. I only have, a, like, I think, like, four videos to upload left. And I really wanted to interact with the community of Advocate Life this season. And um, for the last few videos, I want to include all of you, my viewers and my friends and everyone who watched my videos. Thank you guys all for watching. You're all super cool and amazing. Uh, if you want to be in this upcoming video, leave a comment down below with your username. And we're going to do a hot or not. You guys have been asking for me to do a hot or not for so long. So I think Mary Spade and I, we've been planning to do it together. Uh, and then that's it. That's it. So I'll be uploading that video here in, in like two, three days. Thank you guys all for being a part of my channel. As always, my name's Donnie Pooh. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Visit rgemcoats.com. And until next time. You're a hater. I'm recording this. No, you're not. Mm -hmm. The part that you said, I'm a hater, I'm going to include in the video. I said, you're a hater. That's what I just said. You're a hater. You're a hater. <laughs> <laughs>